What's going on everybody? Fishing the Odds here. I just wanted to give a little update on how today has been. Um, I got out here a little bit after first light, probably a half an hour late today. I ran into a kayak fisherman this morning who landed a, a hatchery. He got his hatchery and uh, 20 minutes later his buddy hooked two fish, you know, over the course of 20 minutes. And, uh, and yeah, he lost both of those fish. That's probably a pretty pretty bad day to lose two fish in a day. Um, I didn't get clips of them fighting their fish or nothing because I was out here just a little bit too late. But what I will say is that uh, there was a morning bite at Selwood this morning. It's March 31st. You know, probably another half an hour after they hooked their fish, when I got out there, I hooked a fish on a herring. Now, I let that thing bite for like five seconds, five or six seconds. And it seems like that fish was still chewing on it. I'll tell you what, check this clip out. As you can see, I was too quick to grab the rod. That's no good. If, it even no matter how much time it's been, if it looks like that fish is still chewing on that herring, just let them keep chewing. You know, I made a mistake today and I, you know, I got impatient and I picked up the rod too early and it probably probably resulted in losing that fish. I'm definitely not happy about that. So, I fished Selwood another couple hours and then once the morning was over with, the afternoon I went up to the spaghetti factory and I, uh, I got the pro troll out. I got a day pass for my girlfriend here and we got two pro trolls out and I, I got a takedown on my pro troll. Pro trolling spinner. Um, I was trolling upriver, you know, probably two and a half miles an hour. I got a nice pump on my pro troll and I lost that fish. I picked it up, as you can see right here, fish is gone. So the kayak fisherman lost two fish this morning. His buddy in the kayak landed a fish and I lost two fish. One in the morning, one in the afternoon. So there's some fish around, guys. Check one, I, lost I mean, look at the counts. The counts went down a little bit, but that don't mean they're not in the system, right? So there's still some fish in the system. One thing I did is I went, you know, from Selwood in the morning, Spaghetti Factory in the afternoon. Now I'm all the way down by Swan Island right now. I'm traveling, guys. I'm looking for these fish. I fish a few hours at each spot, you know, if I'm only coming across one fish, they're probably not there, right? So I'm scouting, I'm looking around. That's what I'm doing right now. Water temperature, as you can see, went up to 49 degrees. We're 49.3 degrees now. It's getting a little warmer in the afternoon. And as that shine comes out, that sun right now, as, you, as I speak, comes out. It's a good time to get that pro troll out, get that thing kicking, pull some fish off the bottom. That's what I was doing. and. Uh, it works, but I don't, I don't have any fish to show for. I lost my fish. I'm pretty beat up about that. You can ask my girlfriend here. <laughs> pretty pissed off about it, but that's the way fishing goes sometimes. I'm just out here giving you guys reports, so chase that bite. I'm gonna be heading back up to Selwood for the evening bite. Morning and evening bite at Selwood is kind of what I'm gonna try to do here. I'm fishing suspended on both of these rods right now, my pro trolls. Going just a hair slow, wind picked up. I'm gonna speed us up in a minute. But uh, just keep searching guys, look for those fish. Don't fish the same spot all day. I got plenty of gas in the tank here. After I fish this uh, area down here by Swan Island for a few hours, I'm gonna go back, back to Selwood, so. Wind, we got, we got some bad wind. <laughs> We had some crazy gusts today that, man, I thought we were in a hurricane. <laughs> Comes out of nowhere, it's a crazy gust. Anyway, um, I got the top of my boat today. It's not complete. The sides are still being worked on by uh, Cheryl. But it kept us dry, so we're still fishing. My woman's dry, she's happy. So we're uh, fishing 42 feet of water right now. This rod right here is closer to the bottom. That rod's probably 10 feet up. I'm looking for those fish. 
So water temperature at 49 degrees, to me that tells me these fish are a little bit more active. So check out the wind report for the, for the day guys, and check out the wind report for the week right here. As you can see it's supposed to be 10 mile an hour winds on average I would say, but uh, that don't mean nothing to me. Water visibility, let's talk about that for a second actually. We got really good visibility out here. We've probably got seven, eight feet of visibility. Check out this chart, the turbidity chart. That'll kind of show you where we're at. Definitely good visibility to be fishing a pro troll. Pull those fish out of the bottom. Fish your pro troll, guys. It's warming up, you know, it's not low 40s no more. We're up in the high 40s, almost 50 degrees now, so fish your pro trolls. Stay tuned, try to get another fish in the boat. It's only uh, one o'clock right now. Sun's coming out. Hopefully we can find another fish. Here. The bird literally landed in my boat. Come get it. Here, buddy. All right guys, March 31st. We're back up at Selwood Bridge. Got a lot of wind out here, man. We, we went through hail storms, snow storm, not, not snow, but we went through hail rain, wind storms, you name it, you know. We went through all the storms today. <laughs> still, still hooked those two fish that we hooked, uh, one in the morning, one in the afternoon, and that was it, guys, so. I just wanted to touch base with you again around four o'clock. That's about what time it is right now. Still no fish. Uh, check this out, guys. If you look around me, there's two other boats. Check it out guys. These two other boats right here, no fish for them. No fish for any other boats in the area. So it's been tough. Let's get back on track here. So I just wanted to show you guys who's around. Um, there's not many people around, I mean, there was earlier, there was quite a bit of boats this morning. Well, compared to now, there was six, seven boats this morning. And uh, two kayak fishermen and, and myself were the only ones that hooked fish, so. Uh, I don't know, guys. Use your best discretion. Get out here if you want to. It's still a little bit slow. Damn counts are low. I just wanted to give you guys a report on how the river is doing today, so. Uh, later in the day, the visibility is still good. Hopefully you enjoyed this report. Till next time guys. Bye.